I'm very excited. I'm like, like, just like shaking. It's crazy. Um, yeah, I'm just I'm so excited to be here. Uh, it's great. Well, I think it's very unique film, and I'm so glad that they're just like they're pushing it this way. Um, and it, it's it's just like it's the first really like big film for me. So I'm. I wasn't very sure what to expect, but now that I'm here and like in Sundance and everywhere, it's just, it's so fun. Timmy's very different from everybody else. He's, you know, running his own detective agency and everything. He's just, he's, he's different and he's not um, afraid of being himself. Um, and I just hope that people, again, can just take that from the film. Well, I think that it can it can really adapt to all ages because Timmy, he kind of acts older than himself, you know. I mean, he's he's also different in that way again, and he's so professional and so. And then there's also the polar bear and everything, and so I think that the kids would really like that as well. I mean, this is this is the dream, right? I mean, like you just said, we're we're, we're at the Capitan, we're across from the Grauman's Chinese. I still like to call it the Grauman's Chinese. Um, and I'm with Tom McCarthy, an Oscar winner on Hollywood Boulevard. I mean, the, the in anticipation of this movie that we've all been, it's just so special to, to so many of us. And, and I got to bring my kids to the first you know, premiere uh, that they've been able to come to like this. And so, yeah, I mean, we're all kind of nerding out here just with big gleeful smiles on our face. Yeah. I mean, you know, they they picked the right guy to shepherd it in Tom McCarthy. I mean, Stefan's uh, drawings and Stefan's stories uh, lend themselves to, I think, more than just your average kid's story take. And and Tom saw that, and between he and Stefan, to, to put together the tone that they did, like you said, sort of mixing a very accessible um, family comedy, family comedy adventure, with a really neat little character study of this kid and with a, an indie sensibility that I think will play to more than just uh, the, the average family audience. Is we kind of felt that as we were doing it and, and we put ourselves in Tom's hands and and, uh, and, and trusted him and, and, and we've been thrilled with the results as, as we knew we would be. I think it kind of stands out. It feels different. We got to see the screening and it hits different. It feels different than what I had even imagined going into it. It's not silly, it's it's earnest. Um, I cried twice. <laughs> it's not hard, but two times it got me. Uh, it's got a lot of heart and it's so funny. It's, it's honestly terrific. So yeah, it kind of stands on its own. It's very impressive. It hits at every level of anything you'd want in a movie. It's got a lot of heart, but there's struggles too. And the struggles I think are really, really well portrayed and interestingly um, kind of set up. And the, the solution is kind of community and family, which is, yeah, that's absolutely for everyone. Flo is um, very much true to the books, very stern, but loving and big up heart. Um, I had the most fun playing this part. It's my first part, and I can't imagine it going anything better from here. <laughs> like, this might be it. <laughs> I mean, this is such a cliche, but it is literally a dream country. You do, you do the, you know, you'll, you watch movies growing up as a kid, and you think, oh, maybe one day. It, it, I mean, it's still, it's what is not lot not to like about it and it's so exciting knowing i can't wait to watch it with and hear people's reactions and things it's yeah it's very exciting well i think it gives you loads of scope to play because you you have both of those aspects in it it makes it slightly more interesting i think to watch and it's got it, it's got more um soul and heart in it that there's there's a kind of a deeper message in it um that I think Tom McCarthy kind of reminded us of when we were shooting it. I think it's it's a good it's a good union. I hope they feel that to kind of embrace their inner child and that, that, and, and also to just having your an imagination and letting yourself go with where that can lead. Where does that lead you? What ideas that do you have? If instead of just kind of going, oh no, that's ridiculous, just go with it and who knows what will happen and, and I think friendship as well just how important having your buddies and it is lovely the relationship I play Timmy's mum showing them as kind of you know friends they like their teammates it's a really lovely relationship it's not her always talking down to him she kind of talks to him as her friend which is lovely 
It is so amazing. I've not seen the movie yet, so I'm so excited to see it on the big screen because it's so weird when you're filming because you film all these different scenes and now we get to see them all strung together. I'm really excited. You know, this is actually my first movie premiere for Timmy Failure and when we filmed this movie, I was so excited for it to come out, for everybody to see it. I mean, the meaning behind the movie is so important about individuality and being yourself, so the fact that everybody gets to see it now, I'm so grateful and honored. So it's my first movie that I've actually ever been in, so I'm really happy about that. I think it's for everybody because, you know, the main character, Timmy Failure, he's like a wacky detective. He's not normal, and that's okay because nobody's normal. Everybody's their self, and that's really what the movie is talking about, you know. It's okay to be yourself. I mean, you don't have to be like everyone else. So I think everybody's going to really like it, and it's a funny movie, and it's really magical. I mean, the polar bear in this movie, beautiful, and it's so well animated, it literally looks like a real polar bear. So... <laughs> I think they're going to really enjoy it. It's it's kind of like the book, so that's exciting. And the book series is so good. It's written by Stefan Pusty, so it's an amazing book series. I've read it all. I think just the spirit of the movie, right? Uh, it's It's got a lot of... I watched it last night for the first time in about four months because we've been holding the release. And I just thought, this movie is bonkers in the best way. It's got so much texture, so much color, so many great characters. I'm just thrilled with how it turned out. And I'm really excited to see it tonight with a LA audience. There's a lot of humor and a lot of heart in this movie. And, and I think it's a, an original live action movie. And it's the kind of Disney movies I grew up on. And uh, I'm excited for other young people to see it. It's about a young boy who's trying to figure out his place in the world, figure out how to fit in, but hold on to what makes him unique and special to celebrate his differences and and uh, and bring those to the world. And he's got a lot of people helping him to do that, and he has a lot of struggles, funny, but struggles along the way. So I think that is what a Disney movie is all about. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for them to see it and see it with an audience, see it on the big screen. It's a beautiful score, beautiful picture, and uh, I'm, I'm excited. It's one of those nice nights. Yeah, I mean, it's it's independent in spirit, but it's also got a big old polar bear in the middle of it, and it's quirky and unusual. There's a lot of warmth and heart, um, a great deal of emotion, um, and it's also really funny. Tom McCarthy, the director, is amazingly good with both emotion and comedy, and he's done a beautiful job, so I'm really happy with it. I hope they take away from the film that it's an uplifting film. At the end, you feel really good, and you go through a journey, you know? Um, Timmy's really different, and that's a wonderful thing, and the movie celebrates differences, and uh, I, think, uh, I think people really enjoy it, yeah. Yeah, the fans who get to see it from the book, it, um, it, it, it captures what the book felt like when you read it, but it also is a movie that you will understand to be different and, and feel different and, and enjoy it in a wholly different way. Um, so I think it provides both things for the fans, yeah. I hope and believe when they leave the theater they'll feel uplifted and happy. There's a lot of hope. There's a lot of um, great, uh, wonderful, emotional spirit. It's great. I think the fans of the book series should really look forward to this. Um, it's kind of a fan treatment, you know? Tom McCarthy, he's really, really funny. Um, he's got a great sense of personality, great sense of humor also. And, you know, he keeps it fun, but he also, like, gets the job done. Well, it's very, very nice that we, uh, it's a movie where most of the stars are 10 years old or so, which is uh, unusual for me. And uh, I think each of the personalities of the children is brought out very, very nicely.